Go get it. I don't want that stick. Good morning, world. It's early-ish. Not crazy early. Waiting on Ernesto. So we're gonna get this package. Because they didn't deliver it. And we need them because it's the mouse pad. So... I'm gonna take a dab. Oh, there's Ern right there. My dude just pulled up. I'm texting somebody. My grassies get cut again. In 20 minutes now, Ern's still in the car. Oh. See, he's trying to hide behind the car now. Look at the faux hawk. Oh, look at that swagger walk, son. Swag. Oh, still coffee on my white boost. Faux hawk in the building. I forgot to tell you all about the modeling agency that Did I they trolled, see and your now they've been hair? calling me. Did they see your hair or something? No, well, well I saw them. They're like Carson Monthly up in this bit. Last time you called me Carson Weekly. I went from daily to <laughs> weekly to monthly. Um, so I'm at the Arapahoe County Fair, and you know there's different booths, and one is oh, a yeah. talent and modeling agency. Fair is where you're going to find that knockout talent for the next cover girl. So I just walk up. There's three, like, 18 to 20-year-old girls, like, really thin, you know, model wannabe looking girls. Uh -huh. And I just walk up. Up and I go like this and I go and they're just looking at me like can we help you sir yeah this is a modeling agency right I'm, I am kind of I want to be a model I go so how's this work fill this out and someone will get in touch with me. being all polite about it it says parents name they go well for you it's not parent you just can put your own number there you'll be fine so we're normally looking for children to exploit but since, that, you, yeah. since you're ready to sign up all your information go right ahead dickhead. like an idiot <laughs> I don't know when to stop trolling so I give them my real number and now every day at like four o'clock I get a call and hey this is just uh, Melinda from over at the whatever whatever modeling oh agency. God. Do I troll them to the next level now? See what they want. Send them headshots. Me with my shirt off. I mean, do we take? I might do it. I might take the call. We troll this into a career. What are you talking about? That's what I'm saying. This is where I'm going with this. I'm gonna make you know I'm working with some companies now. I'm doing kind of some amateur modeling, but I'm looking to get. Oh, into what, amateur bigger. modeling? My shit's amateur now. No, not you. No, not for. you. Oh, I do model for you. I was just saying I was trying to make up a story of my People modeling career. People think that your fitness journey but started I, from trolling. It really started because you wanted to be a model. Yeah, forgot that I'm a model for you too. I'm a model. I call him back like, yo, actually I forgot I've been modeling for a year. I need to change my resume yeah, on you. Actually, I am a model guy. We're gonna cabinet can. I like it. It's crooked. Um it's okay, Ernie. It's a cabinet cam. It can be crooked. Dude, when people talk about the pixels, you get triggered. Because I do. Because people are like, oh, it's a little pixel. I'm like, what? Like, what do you mean? If I hit through that, I'm testing the speed of yeah, something happening. I don't know what it's it is. It's your phone. Yeah. Same thing that happens when someone tries to call you. You can't hear you talk. You know why? Inside your phone, there's antennas. And you drop your fucking. <laughs> True. If there's like a microchip in everybody else's phone that's an antenna, you got fucking bunny ears inside your shit. But you on my family plan? No, because I got Joe Kenick on mine. That's the only reason. Joe can get the axe. The thing about Joe, he pays all the time. Think about Joe's, he's 45 and he needs his own fucking phone plan. And he can, dude. He's got credit. Kind of, he owns a house. I don't know. I think there's something he enjoys about the, like, it keeps us in contact. Like, once a month, I gotta hit him up. That's a good thing. I should do that with all my friends. Like, have one bill on everybody's day. But the, this health insurance, we're good, right? Just broke my leg. Listen, bro. Put this in your name. Why? Keep us in contact, man. We're 45. I'll be able to call you. Like, what's the password? Let's smoke a joint. I'm ready. Okay. The vlog was great. It brought me to tears. No, it was very heartwarming, though, dude. It didn't bring you to tears. It didn't bring me to tears, but it got me a little like, I was like, wow, this is really. Wow, Teddy has Felix. Yeah, it was amazing. Who would have thought? They get all the B roll of the night, and they felt like traveling. I felt like I was traveling. Oh, you were with me? Yeah, it did. You know, the first rule of filmmaking is to show and not tell. I feel like you were there, we're good. What is wrong with this weed? You're There's crazy. nothing wrong with it, but you'll see the taste. Is I just smoked just, it. It's great, dude. It's, it's not, citrus. It's yeah. straight up citrus. You got a better bud than me. You're out of your mind, bro. It's got a little citrus. It's just not as pungent as I'd like it. It reminds me a little. It's, it's not like that New York shit. No, it actually that reminds cat. me of that New York. It reminds me of the Blue Nightmare. Cat. It is nothing like the Blue Nightmare that you used to smoke. God, I wish we had a little bit. I should have just saved one little crumb of that shit. We we'll go get some. Ernie's head. Stash, break in case of emergency. I literally used to fly to New York and you couldn't even finish one joint. podcast tomorrow. Or Saturday. Saturday. Joint. What's Saturday? What are, what are we on? Wednesday. At least Thursday. 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 What are we on here, Toots? It's a fucking scam, bro. You signed up to be a model at a Fair. Well, this is it. I'm documenting what it's like to sign up to be a model at a fair. It's gonna be some casting couch type shit. Fair, fair play. 
is what they're Fair play. Is what, your, is what your little porn thing is called. Welcome to Fair Play. <laughs> hey, I'm dirtier. Listen, I don't do porn. <laughs> I'm not getting involved. Listen, I'm not. No sex stuff unless I read the script first, all right? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah. Had a couple of experiences in Hollywood. I'm not trying to relive that. I had to spend a lot of money on therapy getting it situated. Oh my god, I should have him call while I'm here. Talk to me, your agent. Hey, listen, yeah. listen, listen. This is fucking Teddy Two Tex, all right? T C E H, all right? Not K. Don't get it wrong. Don't get it twisted. That's my fucking business card. Don't get it wrong and don't get it twisted. <laughs> listen, listen. Don't get it wrong and don't get it twisted. I'm here to make money, not friends, all right? This is my guy here, Dirty Earn. We want to start this up, all right? Have a great name, great title. Fair play. Here's a scenario. Our dirtiest of Verns here is working a carousel. Susan from down the street doesn't have enough money to ride. I only have a pony out back, sweetheart. They're just so creepy. Oh, yeah. I mean, so, dude. It, I but just imagine the real situation, though. Like, people who really sign up to be impressed. That's why I'm exposing this. this. Super hot chick in fucking the middle of nowhere, fucking Iowa. It's like, I think I could be a model. Some guy like you who's running the shit. But what do they do? What do they just tell those young girls to approach anyone that looks cute? Probably what it is is a scam to sell a photo, some photo work. The only thing people are selling are dreams, homie. That's it. They're going to pay me. No, they're not. I'm gonna pay you to go away. Like, sir, please, no one's ever called us back this much. And we steal money from young girls. Let's do a documentary, let's find out where they are physically, the head office. Go down there and be like, you didn't pick me! You didn't pick me! I got my headshots! I look beautiful! On top of a mountain skate, looking like a fucking nickelback. Dude, person this is there. why I want it, because I'll go do that photo shoot with Brandy. We can like, do that photo shoot now. It's like a majestic photo of you in black and white on top of a roof. I'm picturing black and white, you shirtless with black jeans on. Just like a Michael Jackson thing with the winds blowing. You can't see anything but your body and your feet. A little bit of I black. Tell There's a little bit of black rock and everything else is like white. The contrast is just beautiful in my mind. It'd be a great photo for your living room. I'm just saying. I'll get Everybody that come in be like, what the fuck is that photo of you? I still really want to go to that steakhouse with all the animal heads on the wall. I don't know where you're talking about. The oldest one in Denver. Mmm. It's like a hunter looking place. Like there's heads of animals everywhere and you get venison steak and all this weird meat. Buckhorn Exchange. It's supposed it's to like Gold Corral. It's not a chain. It's an old. That was just some old restaurant. I don't know. It had these are reviews. I thought it had all these animal heads. That's what I was going for. So while you're eating a steak, you just want to be stared at by other animals that have been hunted? That's your that's your aesthetic. I want to be surrounded by the fucking dead animals. screams of dead animals while I eat their friend. Not Charlie! You're on one today. <laughs> you killed Charlie! We have to watch you eat him! The fucking Hannibal Lecter shit. You're gonna watch all your friends get eaten. <coughs> After I'm done with you, I'm gonna hang your head there. And I'm gonna make you watch forever. Your cousins, cousins. <laughs> Your friends is fucking children. Every single fucking animal. Oh. You ever hear the Noah's Ark? Well, this is Noah's restaurant. Dude, you would like the sign on the rooftops at old school. <laughs> I love the sign. I would like the sign. Yeah. Great. Yeah. <laughs> it's really a reason to go there. Yeah. I got a neon sign, Teddy. You're gonna love it. We got an hour drive to UPS after this. An hour? Hour round trip. Great. I'm going to LA the 13th to get Alex. Look at this row of animal heads staring at you while you eat. Mm, yeah, that's the family. Some fucked up shit. You'll watch your entire bloodline be slaughtered and enjoyed. <laughs> <laughs> Shit's gonna turn me vegan, dog. Oh my god. Dude, I didn't like his post today, and then I'm like, why am I following this dude? And then I go look. His name's like Vegan Warrior or something. It's like, alright. You're getting on follower. Like the corner table underneath the buffalo. I'll be ordering mm. a buffalo burger tonight. Hey, you got my special spot there. I like to be under the buffalo. I like to look at the sadness over there in that deer's eyes. Dude, we gotta go here now. Now that we're talking about, we gotta go win the caverns. We gotta go. Denver really needs better restaurants. I can't tell you the last time I haven't had McDonald's in 24 weeks since I started my run. 24 weeks. Feel like a little calendar. <laughs> it's like a little Ronald McDonald calendar, and you each little date you just put a little sad fry face on each one that you don't get it. <laughs> that is how it feels. One day I'll get a bacon cheeseburger plain, just ketchup and cheese. One day. It's it's <laughs> true. I pass McDonald's and I'm just like, man, one day. It's branding. Do you watch that McDonald's movie? Wait. <laughs> the Founder? Yeah, I loved it. It's really good, yeah. Oh boy. So here's the thing. So they're saying 
No, it's fine. They're saying everything is is supposed to be printed by the end of the day today, which is great. They're shipping Friday, but they say ground shipping is not doesn't make it till Wednesday. So they don't do a different shipping. That's six hundred dollars in shipping. They said if we switch to two day air, get it here on Monday like we want, it's three thousand dollars. What the fuck? I really then this being said, I think I mean we gotta figure out a way to do it the best way, but I think maybe before friends and family you know like we already talked about this. Why are we reiterating the same shit? What do we say? That we're gonna order the next drop first yeah. because we know a gauge of what we need to order. I don't oh, know so why. then we're good. Well, who said we weren't good? Other than I don't know. Just start stressing. Them. What are you stressed about? That you're gonna get stressed. About what? About the timeline of this. I don't like that it's taking that long, yeah. but it's like no different than anybody else. It was impossible to do this the first time this way, other than this way. It is what it is. The camera's on, right? You just said if we want it Monday, it's $3,000. There's nothing to be stressed out about, dude. Yes, in the future going forward, it'll be a lot smoother and easier. It's a brand new thing. We're like working in that. Dude, and I was thinking we could fly to ship it, but still have to then mail ourselves the other half. You know, because that was my first idea. I was like, fuck it. It's only two days, dude. Okay, okay. Like, it's not a big You're deal. nice and calm. I just, I, I know the big thing to use time, but my job is to get it here on time and do it as best as we can, but. Yeah, but I am like so fucking sick and tired of fighting the reality of situations. That's what it is, you know what I mean? And like, some people may get upset. That's fine. That's their. Yeah. prerogative doing everything we can and yeah. so i'm not gonna if we were just chilling all the stuff's sitting here but we just don't have time to pack and fold it and i you know that's different it's like it's out, this is out of our control and i can't do anything about it so i have to wait i love my orange and blue shit yeah that's how we do it the tank top with the, with the long sleeve it's good ernie's in stressed out mode the battery is dying to stretch you out even further. We gotta, I think you gotta unpack the bag. I think hey, I think you need to stop talking about my bags. I don't have to unpack my bag. You just have to reach into this compartment here. You're acting like I'm your fucking grandma and you can't go in my purse or some shit. Here, my bag's unpacked, grandma. Nice. I got the batteries that you need. Where's our package, please, sir? It's not here. What? They don't have my package. I'm throwing something, so you should feel. I'm gonna tell them we're live. We're live right now. There's we're live, Channel Three people. News. We're out here looking like vloggers because that's the new wave. <laughs> this is the dirty arm of Channel Three News. This camera is weird. Just go with it. Listen, we're with CNN, Central News Network. Maybe you've heard of us. I don't know. Hi, Fox and Friends. You heard of the Friends? We're the Friends. Check it out. Here's my card. Oh, why the small camera? You ask. Because it fucking works. But you want to carry around a fucking 45-pound camera on your shoulder? No, you do not. All right. I'm tired of fucking hiring and firing these assholes. They don't want to carry the camera this thing weighs less than a pound get yourself a fucking gorilla pod let's go news van what the fuck we need a news van for you know why they have a van because they have a fucking camera the size of a bmx bike on this motherfucker's shoulder <laughs> yeah that's how it goes that's the story hazardous materials team is out getting out of here we got a spillage you heard about ebola in no. denver no because he just came back from Africa and very close to a lot of sick people there. No. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully they find who it is and they just off him. What do you mean? They they know who he is. He's in oh. the fucking. You think, you, you think they should just kill him? <laughs> Three days ago, Denver hospital on lockdown after possible Great. Ebola outbreak. Drop a bomb on the whole place. <laughs> <laughs> what are they saying now? Does Ebola kill you? Uh, yes, absolutely. He says they, his test came back negative and they removed him from isolation. So now now he's out just... They got him in the delivery room saying yeah. hey to all the newborn. <laughs> hey, you're good. False alarm. Go ahead. Good thing they didn't kill him. It was just a cold. We're out here at UPS live with CNN News. For some reason, I missed this beautiful customer parking that's wide open right near the door. <laughs> that's a fancy looking head you got there. Thanks. We we film everything. You guys do tours, it says? No. Oh, that's, it, that's for employees. You want a job. Who are trying to want, who want a job. Oh. I wouldn't mind it, but I just... Okay. What do they put on there? Some sort of gifts. You here for a package, too? Yeah, I'm here for a couple. <laughs> nice. What do you got? Anything good? Something for my boss, I don't know. Oh, hopefully, nice. hopefully it's cool. Yeah, Teddy married me. Well, he didn't marry me. He <laughs> married my wife and I. I'm an internet celebrity, as a matter of fact. It's taking a little longer than yeah, expected. Exactly. It's taking a little longer than expected. I didn't want to say that loud. Still here waiting. Got him. Got We're him. in. We did it. <laughs> oh shit, they're dope. Yeah, they're, dope. they're a little thin. Uh, yeah, they're so cool. 
you go, there's yours. All right. Ugh. See how you feel, see how I feel. Yeah, that's a good idea. See how your wife feels. <laughs> Don't put that in the block. Okay, I won't. I don't know if I showed y'all. I got this A-Life board just to hang up. I'm not gonna skate on it, obviously. New block, look at that. Ugh. I'll boat out. People were trying to say that these had different colors, like that they were different patterns, but I don't think they are. These are the same as the ones I've seen. Marble in these, in case you have not put that one together yet. Some people were trying to say that when it stretched out, it turned white. It definitely does not. A green base and the black looks like it was dyed onto it. Extra laces in that bitch. We're not gonna get into the whole people are sleep. Like, I don't give a fuck. People are doing whatever they do. Yes, if this shoe had released uh, two years ago, it would be crazy, but it's not years ago so really who cares fits like a regular and in the hmm. i wonder if what people want is that to be pitch black so like when you put the shoe on you can kind of see the green come through on the toe that gives you like a vertical line look a little bit the green definitely can show through once it stretches out a little bit but yeah these are still uh online i actually got a second pair of these for half off I don't know. I don't know if I'll keep the first pair or just wait for the second pair to come in and send these back to not have a double. Because I did pay a regular price for this one because I didn't know when it dropped if it was going to sell out or not. You never fucking know anymore. Usually now, NMDs sit, which is great because these are still there. You can still get them. Dope NMD. I will say that some people are really not going to like the fact that you can see the green come through on the black. I'm going to assume there's no way to do the black base and dye it green. It's probably just a process thing, um, but still a dope shoe nonetheless. I think that's a, a very strong nitpick. Dope shoe, NMDs, boom, boom, boom. Y'all already know, still the dude doing this thing. Talking about this thing. I like these laces though. It's like a rope lace. Can't even tell if it's black and white or black and green, but I like it. I fucking like it. What is today? Thursday. Uh, I almost forgot. Uh, so. I, oh, that was a loud ass clap. StockX, the homies, the family, the people that I love, the people that love me back, the people that check out the shoes to make sure they are legit. Speaking of shoes that may have gotten away a couple of years ago, this is your chance to essentially get a pair for free or depending on the shoe, get it for, uh, you know, at least they're taking care of some of it for you. I'm gonna split it between two people. I'm gonna do a first place prize that's 500 bucks. Second place prize that is 200 bucks. All you have to do, follow StockX through the link in the description and subscribe to StockX in the link, through through the link and wait, yeah, through the link in the description. And then you need to comment on this vlog. This is not stuff that I normally ask you to do. This is StockX rules, just so we're clear. But comment on the vlog on what it is that you would like to get. You know, I guess I want to know what you're going to get. I think some people think if they pick a shoe I don't like that they're not going to get picked or something like that. And that's really not how I'm going to do it at all. I don't even really know how I'm going to pick it. You know, a lot of times it's with a randomizer. I don't really know. I don't really know. There's no rules. I just get to pick two winners. Yeah. So comment down below what shoe you're going to get. But also, hmm. Tell me what shoe you want. 
give me a story about a shoe you missed out on and uh, we'll pick some winners here after the weekend. I don't really know when. Tell me what you're looking for. Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Cause I really wanna, wanna a zigzag. I love you, peace.